It is a troubling crime trend and Pittsburgh police say they have to get a handle on it. That trend, a huge jump in the number of stolen firearms. Jessica Gway joins us live from Pittsburgh Police Headquarters with the latest. Jessica. The city's crime analyst says most of the stolen guns were swiped from vehicles, so Pittsburgh police are pleading for people to be responsible and keep guns secure. They're even giving out these gun locks for free to anyone who wants to, to, to um, keep their guns secure. Pittsburgh police are troubled by a rash of firearms thefts across the city. People plain being negligent with firearms. Detective Russell Kane with the Firearms Tracking Unit says they saw a 38% increase in just the first six months of this year. At this time last year, 156 guns were reported stolen. And so far in 2022, 215 firearms have been reported stolen. With gun violence prevention being a priority of the Pittsburgh Bureau of Police as well as the mayor's office, we feel it's important to shine a light on this increasing trend in order to mitigate the number of illegal firearms that are being added to our streets daily. Detective Kane and crime analyst Heath Johnson say many of these firearms were snatched because of careless gun owners. A large percentage of these are firearms reported stolen from vehicles and a large percentage of those are uh, reported stolen from vehicles that are unlocked or at least no signs of forced entry. We've had people leave their guns in cars in high, high crime areas with the windows down and the doors unlocked. You're just asking for problems. This is where the guns are coming from, the majority of the guns. They believe ownership responsibility is becoming a serious issue from people not keeping their guns records to actually hiding them in public. We've had people report their guns stolen. Well, I was not allowed in a bar, so I went across the street and I stuck my gun up in a tree. We've had other people that well, I was on my way to work. I can't take my gun to work, so I stuck it under the bushes on the north side. Detective Kane says they have 455 recovered firearms so far this year. Of those, only 37 were reported stolen in the city and 45 were stolen elsewhere. They're urging people to use gun safes in homes and gun locks in vehicles. Pittsburgh police even offers gun locks to anyone free of charge at any zone location. And these gun locks are a simple means of preventing any additional guns from becoming tomorrow's means of violence. They're planning to make these gun locks available at upcoming community events as well. Reporting live, Jessica Gway, KDKA News.